What's up, everybody? What the fuck is going on? What's really going on, mother? Oh, my little teta. What's really going on, motherfuckers? What the fuck is up? Happy motherfucking Friday, bitch. I've been all over the place today. It's gonna be my daughter Sophia's birthday on um, Halloween. She's a Halloween baby. But we're gonna do a little something, something in the weekend. So I don't like doing fucking parties. I don't like doing none of that shit. None of that shit. I'd rather go on a little vacation with my kids and my husband. Getting out of the fucking city. Even if it's like next city. I don't give a fuck. As long as I'm in a hotel and I don't have to clean, you know. But anyways, I still cook though. I still make tortas and burritos because I'm, I'm such a cheap ass. And you know motherfuckers be grabbing their dicks. Grabbing their balls and all kinds of shit. And I just rather do it myself. I mean... I do scratch my button, but not when I'm cooking, bitch. <laughs> but anyways, I want to talk about this. I know everybody and their mama be talking about it. Mr. Tank. You know, I've never listened to his music. I just know that he's, you know, he's out there. You know, he likes to people. He likes for people to talk about him. I get it. I understand. You know, now that this is what, this is what singers do now. You know, back in the day, you know, I'm not acting like I'm all old and shit. But back in the day. People would actually make good music, you know? I'm not trying to sound like, oh my God, like my day, back in my day. But back in my day, you know, we bought a whole CD. And when you were a real motherfucker, you didn't skip none of them songs. None of them songs. They were all bangers. But now motherfuckers, you know, right before they're going to drop an album or a fucking whatever, real remix, they have to say some bullshit. They have to say something like, ah, like, ooh, or wear a fucking dress. Especially in the like hip hop R and B community, it's always some bullshit. But anyways, so this motherfucker is talking about um men sucking dick. Okay, if you suck dick once, it's okay. If a man sucks dick twice, it's okay. Cause you might not like the taste. You know, you might not like the taste. And the lady was like, I don't know who said we're not talking about chicken here. So let me show you a little clip, and I'll be right back. <laughs> no, nope, but, but let's dig into it, right? Okay. <laughs> that so he did. He sucked the dick once, right? Mm -hmm. And then he's like, I'm not sure if I liked it or not. Let you know me try saying? it again. Let me try it mm -hmm. again. And then he says, you know what? Not for me. Don't like the taste. You see what I'm saying? So Don't like the taste. We're not talking he's... about chicken. We're talking no, about right. dick in. Well, you know what? <laughs> dick in his jaw. Dick in you, his jaw. How you made a bar out of chicken <laughs> and dick. Because she's an artist at heart. Natural. comes natural. Um. But it doesn't mean he's gay. It means he sucked dick twice. Okay. I feel like to me, it doesn't fucking work like that. I have been around gay men. I grew up with two of my best friends were gay. And even though they denied it, they did deny it. They didn't want to come out as gay men. One of them even had a baby in high school. Well, he didn't have a baby. He, had a, he fucked with a girl. That, if you look at the Mosca, fuck her. He had a baby with a girl. He, Of course he didn't stay with her because he was fucking gay. I feel like Gay men is, when you're gay, it's not like, oh, I might be gay, I might not be gay, I might be gay. I might. It's like, you're gay. You're attracted, not only, I feel like a lot of people just want to think all oh, gay men are all sexual. It's just about the sex and that's it. And they're just little, se little, little sex fucks, you know, sick fucks. I feel like it's stupid. Um, a lot of these gay men, they really want to get married. They want to have a fucking family. I know a lot of people are like, ooh, gay people can't have families. It's not okay. God is going to fucking kill you or whatever. It takes any to help. But nah, I feel like this motherfucker is making fun of people that are really actually gay. And then when they blow up and people are like saying, oh, well, why are you sucking dick? Why are you talking about sucking dick twice? You know, it's not that, it's not a thing. And no, because real men, straight men, like, Men that love the pussy, men that love women, they won't even think about dick. If they, if they see their homeboy with um, with their dick out, they'll call their ass out. Put that dick away. I don't want to see none of that shit. None of that shit. And it's not because they're homophobic. It's just that I feel they don't like nobody to be testing them. They don't like none of that bullshit. Like yes, a lot of guys they like to fuck around and like say some gay shit or whatever, like fucking around. But real men, the men that are straight, they won't even think about balls or a dick or putting their dick in an ass. And I remember back in the day, you know, I had a friend 
he was gay he loved to suck dick he loved to suck dick he would tell me erica look at my lips they're so purple because of all that dick that i've been sucking and i was like what the fuck he's like yeah see that guy right there i suck his dick and i'm like well that motherfucker has a girlfriend and I would be like, that motherfucker has a girlfriend. He's like, no, yeah, he has a girlfriend. But a lot of these motherfuckers, they say, oh, well, if he sucks my dick, I'm not gay. Because I'm getting my dick sucked, you know? And I was like, no, that makes you gay. You're still letting another man fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? You're still letting another man touch your dick. So time passed, and he told me this crazy story. So he was his friend. And this guy was very popular. He was a Mexican with green eyes, and they called him green eyes. And some of you, you guys that know me, that know me out from, you know, the real world, um, might know who I'm talking about. So this motherfucker would fuck anything, Mr. Green Eyes. So I guess one time, he was fucking some regular hood rat. And my friend, the one that loves sucking dick, he opened the door. He saw him fucking the girl from the back. So he jumped in and started fucking him while he was fucking her. And guess what? The motherfucker, Mr. Green Eyes, he didn't stop. He didn't care. He kept going. Because if he let himself to get his dick sucked, that means that he liked dick. Call it what you want. Time passed. He got married. And guess what? He got divorced. Because he was gay this whole time. Because it's, it's not, you can't taste dick and say, oh, well, I don't like the flavor. You can't do that shit. If you're gay, you're fucking gay. Back in the day, I used to be, I've always been attracted to females. I think females are the most gorgeous thing in this motherfucking world. But guess what? I like the smell of balls. I like how Mario's balls smell. That's because I'm attracted to males. And yes, I've kissed girls before. I know, my little secret. I've kissed girls before. I've licked titties. But that was just because it was fun, you know? I'm, I wasn't trying to be gay. I wasn't trying to be like whatever. I was just like, you know, but I would never lick pussy because I can't, I would never... I would fucking, like, be so scared and be like, oh, pussy, because I have a pussy. You know what I'm saying? And so for Tank to make fun of this situation just to get clout, that's what he's doing. He's trying to get clout. It's like, no, my man, you should be, like, you should think, oh, I, I have enough talent to go by my talent. And I don't have to say all this bullshit to get fucking attention. But what he's doing, he's getting his little attention. <laughs> so, you know, he could get views or downloads or whatever the fuck people be doing nowadays it's just stupid you know he can't rely on his music no more i guess he's not feeling himself he's not feeling his music and then he's telling people oh we hope they're homophobic trying to play the homophobic card i don't think so i don't think people are homophobic everybody is out everybody like ah. everybody's out in the open now nobody gives a fuck anymore so he everybody was just like whoa what the fuck did you say because straight men they don't think about dick they don't want to try once they don't want to try twice that's like kids when they're when they're thinking they're gay, that's different, you know? They're like, they're not gonna go and jump on somebody's dick right away. It's gonna take time. They're gonna be, oh, well, I'm gonna suck dick first, and then I'm gonna do this. It takes steps, you know? But anyway, this is my little two set, bitch. Um, I hope you guys have a good ass motherfucking weekend. And yeah, peace out. And to all my bird gang, 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 gang motherfuckers, I love you. Peace.